If you served in Southwest Asia any time between 1990 and the present and have a medical condition related to your deployment, it is important for you to know that the VA classes certain chronic medical symptoms as presumptive. Three new respiratory conditions have been added to the list of presumptive conditions by the VA. If you're a veteran who has been diagnosed with chronic asthma, rhinitis, or sinusitis within 10 years of a qualifying period of service in Southwest Asia and certain other areas, your disability claim can be processed on a presumptive basis. This means that if you have one of these conditions, you don't need the usual amount of evidence to file a disability claim and can more easily secure VA disability compensation. Thousands of veterans were exposed to particulate matter in overseas military bases, including Iraq and Af Afghanistan. Particulate matter is a mixture of tiny particles and droplets like dust, dirt, or smoke polluting the air. A portion of this particulate matter pollution may have been caused by military burn pits, a method of waste disposal practiced by the U.S. military and its contractors. As a result, veterans who served in Southwest Asia and surrounding areas are now suffering from a multitude of different illnesses and disabilities, including respiratory diseases. This particulate matter presumption impacts veterans who served in Afghanistan, Uzbekistan, Syria, or Djibouti between September 19, 2001 and the present day. It also encompasses veterans who served between August 2, 1990 and the present in the Southwest Asia, Asia Theater of Operations. This theater of operations includes Iraq, Kuwait, and other surrounding countries. Other Gulf War presumptive illnesses include chronic fatigue syndrome, fibromyalgia, and functional gastrointestinal disorders, including irritable bowel syndrome, functional dyspepsia, and functional abdominal pain syndrome. Also on the list of presumptive conditions is another large group of undiagnosed illnesses with symptoms that may include abnormal weight loss, fatigue, cardiovascular disease, muscle and joint pain, headache, menstrual disorders, neurological, neurological and psychological problems, skin conditions, respiratory conditions, and sleep disturbances. If you are facing an adverse medical condition related to your time in uniform, you deserve the disability compensation you have earned. And if your case has been denied, don't give up hope. Instead, give us a call at Cudigan Law for a free evaluation of your case. At Cudigan Law, you have a team of professionals in your corner who know the system and who will fight for your rights.